Hi everybody, uh, today I'm gonna show you about volumetric cloud in Unreal Engine, how you can use it and what is the feature the volumetric cloud have. So if you go to the website dot uh, Unreal Engine 5 uh, volumetric cloud component in Unreal Engine make it upper. So here they say real time uh, cloud rendering using volumetric materials and in the below they explain the volumetric cloud component is a physical plus uh, rendering system that uses a material driven approach uh, to give artist and designer freedom to create any type of cloud they need for their product so this is uh, this is a, uh, a material based uh, rendering uh, cloud rendering system you can see the different kind of uh, cloud in here and different uh, shape so previously they used Unreal Engine use static uh, materials uh, for slide dome and uh, cloud, but uh, now uh, we use uh, cloud uh, as a material. So you can see the below and upper part of cloud, and here you can see the remarks enable and uh, BS shadow maps. The difference: there is a remarks uh, shadow enable and disable function, atmosphere with sunlight and other function. So here you can see the difference between cloud shadow enable and disable. On the right side is enable, left side is disable. This is the uh, earth air atmosphere which we use uh, to see from the satellite. You can make it too. So client ambient occlusion is enable and disable. You can see the difference. There is a sky reflection quality. There is a, a cinematic quality real-time quality set in apply and cinematic quality apply there is a volumetric material we can change the texture so volumetric plugin content this is very useful content if you want to change your cloud just enable the enable it and you need to show enable plugin content so using it you can uh, edit your cloud like this blueprint place cloud you can make cloud like this using this functionality and also you can paint your own cloud i'm not joking it's true <laughs> you can paint your cloud using it so default sample counts and there is other option also please go do go and check the page for more detail so I am now in my uh, project and go to uh, empty level. There is nothing. I go to Windows and ENV light mixture and create a sky light, atmosphere light, uh, volumetric cloud and hide fog. And this is the scene we got with a few clicks. I love the function. So I just uh, select the volumetric cloud. And there is a layer bottom altitude we can change it we can change the altitude and we can uh, make uh, altitude low and make altitude height uh, we can change the height like this you can see it in your the in the scene there is a match distance there is ground albedo color uh, planet radius you can change it and see the change yourself also if you double click and go to the material you can change the material settings i will show it to you later you can turn off the visibility and other function also now if you go to the plugin and search volumetric you will find a plugin called volumetrics this function it is uh, disabled by default you just enable it and restart your engine then you can see the content yourself and if you go to uh, this content and enable the show plugin content you go engine plugin and you can see the volumetric cloud volumetric content and here you find many folder go to the tools go to the cloud uh, compositing blueprints and you will find few name here cloud mask object cloud mask uh, generator and cloud paint bp cloud paint we need this just drag it and uh, drop to your scene 
we can see it properly so I just add a cube I just add a cube and I from the detail make it 0 0 0 and F I go close with, close to it now I just changes the scale x axis 10 y axis 10 and I change the material to a green material so this is our scene this is the cloud so I just made changes to uh, cloud mask generator and object so I just press uh, F and it uh, took me far away but if I go to the cube you can see how big uh, the mask generator and object so I select both of it and make it uh, drag it far away and from there I just go to the content sky and materials here I just apply uh, material to the uh, volumetric cloud we have a default uh, material so select it volumetric uh, m volumetric cloud and edit and our uh, cloud is gone but I just control Z and bring back the cloud and go to the default material it's a material instance but I just show you how you can change the function in here if we increase the value you can see the difference in cloud you can change every function and you can see yourself how it effect on the cloud uh, you can see the difference I make my uh, vapor bigger there is uh, also you can change the color I just change it and you can see the effect on the cloud there are other options also but I just uh, make all the default I just add uh, that material and their cloud is gone now we can make uh, the uh, cloud mask object to more bigger like 20 and it's very big I want to uh, drag it far away so it looks like this small like in here uh, this is the cloud so if we uh, select the volumetric cloud now and change the altitude and height you can see it effect on the cloud and if we press F we can go to the up and from see the cloud from the top view and we can make it more denser and change this other level for example you can change the noise intensity and you can see how it effect on the cloud we can see show debug plane and uh, how it show in debug uh, we write exactly that cloud there are other options also I just made a uh, few changes and I just duplicate alter and mouse left button and drag we can rotate it we can make another duplicate and uh, we can make it more bigger using the scale and I made it's bigger and from the ground we can see the cloud like this and if we change the value from here it will affect the cloud and we can see the cloud from the ground there is a volumetric cloud and we change in the height in here you can see we can make it more higher or you can make it like that 
now i just add volumetric paint and within this function we can paint bluetooth game setting and use volumetric paint in game mode and if we alter and p i make it bigger by f11 and uh, now we can paint you can see we can click mouse left button and paint that loud by ourselves it's a nice feature isn't it and I'm making my cloud as I like this is the cloud and I'm changing the cloud So if we use this material that cloud will be gone which is show and which uh, cloud we paint it it's, it's still there and we can make a, a instance of it and apply it and if we go to the instance here we have uh, some functionality if I make it bigger I can change the cloud uh, density you can see it effect on the cloud I can change cloud detailness <laughs> you can see the how it effect on the uh, level the detail too and noise I can change the noise I can change the albedo color and it will effect uh, to the cloud so there are a lot of more options please uh, check by yourself and explore so this is for today's tutorial bye bye everybody